Queen too? We are back this time. Let's see if it goes through. You think it's gonna go through? Yeah. Wait, what? What? Please wait here for assistance to continue checking. There you, go. you think it's gonna go through yeah. still? Even though they're asking for assistance? Hopefully. Let's cross our fingers. It went through. Donkey. Yes. There you go. You need juice? I don't have juice, Eli. You want me to go buy you juice? I didn't tell you to eat hot Cheetos. I didn't tell him to eat hot Cheetos, but he wanted me to buy him juice after I done went with Layla to go get her another bag of chips because that's this is actually supposed to be Layla's bag of chips. And now you're asking for juice. He was supposed to have this, but he took Layla's bag of chips, caused a tantrum, and I had to get her a whole nother bag of chips. Traveling with toddlers is no joke. Babe over there just minding his business. Now I got to get him juice before he caused another tantrum. You want juice too? Put it on. I think Babe is kind of mad at me. I'll tell you guys in a few why he may be mad at me. Babe. I think Babe is my friend now. <laughs> Let me tell y'all what happened. So basically, I went to go get a sandwich for the kids and I. Let's just say I almost cost us our flight and I was super late. Literally, I had to run. Babe and the kids were calling me, but I paid for the food already, so I had to wait for it, y'all. Babe was a little upset. I was a little embarrassed, I'm not even gonna lie. You know, I made that boo-boo, but again, as the mom I am, and it is Mother's Day, I had to make sure my kids are okay. We are here, we made it, and I did not cause us to miss our flight, which even though we almost did. Hey babe, you, you forgive me? Well, you're lucky it's Mother's Day, bro. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I had, to, I had to relax, guys. I had to calm my spirit, calm my tone. It's just woosah, like Martin said. <laughs> So, so you my friend now? Yeah, I'm your he, friend. he my friend now. Let's go to the temple. We have a dinner reservation and then after we have somewhere that babe planned for Mother's Day for me. So I have no clue what, what to really expect. We are on foot because it's just, we're faster walking than getting a car. It's so beautiful and it looks cool. Hopefully they let us in. So we got seated and now we're gonna choose our food. They brought Eli to the bathroom once again and he's catching somewhat kind of like a tantrum. Layla's catching a tantrum as well. Juju's okay and I'm kind of getting a little stressed out. Take some food, maybe the food is gonna cheer me up a little bit. This is the menu we have here. It's actually looking really good. It's in French. I'm thinking about either going with the lamb chops or maybe um, some steak, some macaroni, and maybe a dessert. Babe, all right? I was, I was mad for some reason. I didn't know what I was mad about. It was news to me that I was mad. This is the drink that I got. I'm gonna try it. It's a mocktail, non-alcoholic. It's like pineapple, lemon, but it's very tropical. I like it. Our food is here. Ay, 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 ay. That was fast. What do you think? It's good? Layla, what about you? Good? What about you, babe? Good? our next spot and this guy seen us walking on the sidewalk and told us basically hey, hey, hey i'll give you a ride that's straight hustle y'all i smell the horses we're here hello hi hi everybody hi everybody yes <laughs> yes <laughs> my name is Medak. 
Their horse is Smokey. Smokey is 24 Smokey. years old. He's younger than me. <laughs> and he goes. I'm the biggest go. ghost. Oh my god! <laughs> we have a building. Now we're gonna show you what's in the Ghostbuster. The movie Ghostbuster has been filmed from here. Now you're gonna see the building. Which is mommy and dad is gonna recognize right away. 1984, first PG-13 movie. Ghostbuster. So babe, the guy that was riding us on the bike. Have a see, Georgia. <laughs> we could have just walked. This could be a very house. The Home Alone Bridge. Yeah. Let's go. Guys, we took some cute pictures. Look at that. Look at that mama and the daddy. Oh, look at it. That's why we made beautiful babies. We we let's go. Let's go. I was, I was <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. I am in the hotel room. And y'all, this was a long day of travel and excitement. I know y'all hear the kids in the background. And you hear Eli streaming. They're going crazy. But I'm going to get ready for bed and they gonna get ready for bed too. And I'ma call it a night, and the next thing you guys gonna see is a room tour of this room. Let me go tell these kids to go to sleep right quick. Hold on. Did we have a good day or what? Yeah! Did we have a good day or what? Yeah! Did we have a good day or what? Yeah! But guess what? It's bedtime now. Good night. You guys a quick room tour this is the bed with a nice beautiful view of times square y'all we have a nice tv area with a desk and a chair then we go to the bathroom the restroom and y'all this restroom looks so nice and legit this can actually play music it tells you the time right here the shower is actually really Nice and relaxing as well. Toilet, of course, for your dookies. Now we go to the kids' room, which we had to book separately. They gave us a whole lot of issues, but we'll talk about it another time. We got their coffee machine, which they don't drink coffee. They got their bed here, their couch. They too have a nice view of Times Square. And their restroom is not too different from ours. You get over here and bam, it's smaller, but it is still cute. Both rooms have these little closet area or closet space, literally for minimal. Don't bring too much stuff because it's not that much space. For my queen. Yeah, Thank you, that. baby. It's mine. No, it's not. It's mine. It's mine. No, it's mine. All right, brush it out. We are once again in a rush hey <laughs> and we're heading to the ice cream museum with the kids y'all so i'm super excited i want to say it was my fault but it was my family fault too because i had to get their clothes and all that stuff eli you have to wait it's not your turn yet it's a long line all right guys so apparently my tour guide told me we were going to the ice cream museum but we're actually going to the summit one summit so this, this that's where we're going right now. tour guide you know so we're going after to the ice cream museum. oh layla you're eight years old now you're eight i can't even pick i'm struggling picking up eli and she's asking me to pick her up oh my god my god this is not it. Eli, do you see this? <laughs> okay. This line is crazy.
91st floor is blue, pink. There's no sound. You can hear? I feel a little shaky. Whoa. Look at this. Wow. That is so crazy. Look at this, y'all. Wow. That is crazy. Eli, you see that? Do you see that? So what would you rate this experience, Layla? 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. What would you rate this experience? 10 out of 10. Babe, what would you rate this experience? 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. I'm gonna rate it at 8.5 out of 10. Eli, what about you? What would you rate it? <laughs> He's still upset that we took his coke from him. I said, no, he can be drinking coke. So I took it and we threw it out. He's, he, he wasn't having it. All right, guys, so we are heading now to a spot called Burger and Lobster. Recommended for my um, little cousin, so I'm excited to try that and eat there. One to ten. Three. <laughs> I'll give the lobster roll at seven point five. Juju, did you like your chicken sandwich? Yeah. Well, your chicken burger? Yeah. What would you rate it? One to ten. Yeah. Layla, what would you rate your burger? One out of ten. Six. A six? I guess she didn't really like it. Do you like McDonald's burger be better? No. So this one was better than McDonald's. Yeah. So it's a W. Still a W because she wanted McDonald's anyway. Oh, you know, I forgot to rate my burger. Like the sauces that they did have. We order all of the sauces and it was like a, I would say a 8.5 out of 10. My lobster though, I thought it was busting with that garlic butter sauce, that lemon garlic butter. It was Mommy. really good. Ice cream museum. The ice cream museum, Eli. Bum raisin. Bum? Bum raisin? What is yours gonna be? Lavender and honey. Lavender and honey. What is yours? Oreo. Oreo? Pink. Pink? Yeah. Somebody come look at this. Oh, look at this. I gotta see this one. Somebody come and look at this. Hey. Look at this.
How many ice cream you got? Do you think you owe me? You gonna have today? I don't know, but if it tastes like this, a lot. Uh oh, Lord, help me, cause I don't know what I signed up for. Daddy's not coming. Daddy said no. He's scared. That was actually really fun. Another ice cream. We're going to the M&M store and this time we are not late. We are here at the M&M store. What's your favorite M&M color? Orange, blue, green, yellow, and brown. That's literally almost all the colors. And red. What's your favorite M&M color? All red. What's your favorite M&M color? Brown and green and blue. Oh, okay. I think I'm attracted to green and orange. Those are my favorite colors. On this here, basically it gives you a color and explains your mood based on the color that it gives you. So let's see if it's kind of right. Your mood is gonna be still, still angry. You, your mood you. is still. Still. You often you. became lost in thought. Would you rather be lost in what? Chocolate. <laughs> Would you rather be lost in chocolate? Yeah. <laughs> Scanning. Maroon. Really got uh, uh, Eli's turn. Do you think they could scan him? He's so tiny. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, goes by feet, I think. I think Eli's too small. It's not taking him. It's not checking him out. Scanning. It's scanning you, Eli. Look, Eli, what is it? Blue. Your mood is blue. blue. You got a cool hat and sense of humor. Oh my god, this is so Eli. Eli. That is so true, don't you think? Yeah, I guess. That is true, okay. Oh. What's the next color, Eli? Dark purple? Okay. Okay, what's the next one? You want brown? Brown? Dark blue? Okay. Ooh, I've never seen black. They have black. Black? black? I never seen silver. Let me see yours. Oh, that's a nice, interesting combo. But let me see yours, Juju. I'm trying to get every single um, um, COVID ID. Oh, that's actually a nice combo. Their bags are super heavy. I don't know how much this is going to cost, so I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous because they said one whole bag, depending on what type of peanuts or what type of M&Ms you get, is $60 yet alone. And they got the ones with the nuts in it, so that's heavy in itself. Come on, Eli. Let's go play, pay for the, the M&Ms. Let's go pay for it. 76 for M&Ms. 
Listen, those M&Ms were $79. Designs, $79. It's nothing but shopping here. I know. It's designed design to make us broke. We just paid $79, bro. Look at this. All of these look nice. I want all of them, but I'm not gonna do it because I just spent $79 on chocolate. Apparently, we have to make our own M&Ms now, so that means more money spent. Yay. Yeah. Yay. Yeah, what you do for kids? Kids, right? Oh. Eli, you ready? Your turn? Yeah? <laughs> He's so ready. Look at Eli's. He's so cute. Eli's m and Yay. $65. That's no, that's for everybody. $65. Oh, okay. $65. Again. Eli, look at yours. Yay. Look. Look at your face. Ooh. That's mine. All right, so we are now heading to the Statue of Liberty. And guess what, guys? Once again, we're running late. Because these kids wanted M&Ms. Got to go through security screening? I never knew that. The water is giving sewage. Mm. Look at this. This is so beautiful. And here is the lady herself. All right, so guys, how was your experience seeing the Statue of Liberty? I see it as Spider-Man. Yeah? It reminds you of Spider-Man. Oh, wow. Babe apparently said he has a surprise for me. I don't know if I'm okay with the surprise, because I don't know. You seem a little sus today. I had to make a right right here, so I don't know. Those who are from New York, do y'all know what's around this area here? Hi, what do you think he's gonna surprise me with? It's or us? Yeah, us. Um, Krispy Kreme's museum. Krispy Kreme. Hmm. That actually sounds good. I could, I could, I could do some donuts right now. <laughs> what about you? Yeah. So let's see. We got Joe's Pizza here. I gotta try it for yeah. sure. Oh. Yeah. This is what you're talking about? Yeah, you <laughs> I literally said, we got Joe's pizza and I want to try it. And this is the surprise. Pizza. <laughs> Supposedly, this is the best pizza ever. We're going to rate it. We're going to rate it, right? We're going to rate it? You going to rate it? This is not saying thank you. going to rate it? Anyway. But this is the best pizza. Supposedly. It didn't pass the flop test for Layla. Unflopped. It flopped actually. Nasty flop. Let's see if it passed the flop test. Oh, it passed the flop test. Bye. Mm. Good night. Let's try the spinach one. Mm. Oh, that one's good. I like that one more. The pepperoni does it pass the flop? Not quite, but the pepperoni is actually the best one for me. Good morning, guys. Today is our last day in New York. Not even our last day, our literally last morning before I fly. And so far, we are early, so the kids are still sleeping. Everything is packed. Your girl packed everything. Just for, for a few things. And it is currently 7.57, y'all. And I am ready. I got my jacket, I got my bag, I got my clothes, I got my shoes. I got everything on me and I'm just ready to go. My allergies are kicking in again, once again. So I'm having a rough morning with sneezing and itchy throat, all of that, y'all. It's just, this is all new for me. I've never really heard of onset, adult onset allergies, but I guess it's happening. The only time I do be getting allergies in the past is when I was pregnant. It'd be like a whole month 
of allergies and then I'm good after that. But right now, y'all, I've been struggling for the past month, y'all. And New York so far, I enjoyed it. I had a blast looking at all these different things and doing all these different things. And there's so much more to do that we ain't get time to do. We will be doing it next time we come and I'm gonna be trying a whole bunch of food next time we come. We gotta go. Good morning. We gotta go. Gigi don't like missing flights. Hi minions. <laughs> come on. Like we gotta go. We gotta go three hours early come like on, Juju on Juju time. <laughs> I'm still tired right now. You still tired right now? Oh, but we gotta go, Papa. Babe got them dinner. Well, not dinner. <laughs> breakfast. I'm not eating anything. I, I need to go on a detox. I eat too much. I gain too much, too much weight. Um, they got. It looks like mozzarella sticks. Mozzarella sticks in the morning. Yeah, it's hot. You guys got 15 minutes to eat too, right? Y'all struggling out here. Yeah. What time y'all went? Y'all went to sleep when we put y'all to sleep? It's gonna take, no. It's gonna take, it's gonna take like Why? Let me hurry up before we do end up being late. Come on, guys. We got fruits, more mozzarella sticks. Chick, this is lunch or breakfast? Why are you doing this to me? Just don't eat. What you mean? There's food everywhere in the world. You can't escape it. You just gotta have self-discipline. I might have one of these. I ain't gonna lie. I'm joking. Waffles, this is what I'm talking about. Why you gonna have like pancakes and eggs and call it a date? You gotta, you gotta, he gotta bring chicken and waffles and mozzarella sticks and yeah, all the yummy stuff. Press it again. Wow. What I you asking my... me to do? Huh? You trying to what you asking me to do? You trying to get top cheese before we head off. Hey, you gonna add it? You gonna add it to the pickup? To the drop off? <laughs> You trying to act like you ain't do it. Telling me to add it to the to the thing and then when I turn on the camera he act like nothing happened. Y'all already know last time we did that we missed our flight. So he trying to do it again. I guess I'm I guess we're going to try chopped cheese from Bodega. <laughs> we have made it to the airport on time. Bye everybody. I don't know what you're saying bye to you. go. Bye. You paid you gave them the money to go get cupcakes, so you bye. go get you go. This family needs to go see what, what they're buying. Them. So you gotta go with that. Y'all yeah, don't need to see nothing. You, you can go ahead. Think they got the cupcakes, babe. They made it alive. The person that works there recognizes us too. They have to buy ourselves. So we look like horrible parents right now, but <laughs> hey, it is what it is. You got it? Yeah. Wow, you got me one? You got one for me? Yeah, right here. Right here? Um, we got six and the girl gave us one for three. Aw, that's so nice. Thank you. What you got? They went to go say. Um, thank you for watching and look what they gave her. Really? Wow, she is so sweet. Oh my gosh. Thank you. She is so sweet. So if y'all ever in New York, go to M Bake by Melissa's. They are awesome over there, guys. So well, if, if, if y'all the owners, thank you so much. Appreciate y'all. If y'all workers, Y'all better give them a raise or do something because they are awesome, y'all. You like it? You ready to go home? Yeah. Home sweet home. I've never been so over tired and all tripped out. I don't think I'm going to go on a trip for a good minute now. <laughs>